morning everyone today's the day I'm going skiing and I've actually never been skiing before there you go some light so you can see me I'm going to Courchevel it's a little town uh, east of Lyon we're going to be there on the 14th and 15th I'm staying overnight there which is pretty exciting at the ski resort uh, I, yeah, I've never gone skiing before and I really wanted to go skiing for my first time in the French Alps. So this is going to be a video about me going skiing and uh, I hope that I don't break my leg and that I don't fall on my face. This is going to be a great experience. I'm so excited. Yeah, go skiing. Okay, I have to get ready because right now it's 5 o'clock in the morning and I have to catch my bus downtown at 6.30. So yeah, I have to go get ready. So as I'm getting ready to uh, leave for the ski resort, I find that there's a leak in my sink. I was washing dishes, my sink has been clogged for a while, and it's now leaking all onto the floor. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's a big puddle on the ground right here. I'm so annoyed I'm trying to make my tea, trying to make some eggs. And there's a big flood. Why? Why today? We just made it to the chalet and we're settling into our rooms. And this is the view that we have. This is the view. So nice. This is so nice. There's like a balcony and I'm sharing a room with four, three other people. And I'm so excited to go skiing. This is going to be like the best adventure ever. Look at how, the, how nice the view is. This is so nice. Those are the people down there. Ah, oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And there's like other hotels over there. And then those are the ski lifts to go up the hill. I hope I don't die. I hope this is gonna be like a good experience where I'm just like loving life going down the hill like a professional skier. All I need to know really is how to stop and then I'll be perfectly happy with what my life is right now. Okay, bye. So I just got my skis and we're walking now to the slopes. I had to lie and say that I was a professional skier so I could get the poles. See, here's my ski equipment. And it's really hard to walk in these ski boots. I feel like a robot, but I'm gonna make it work. Honestly, I'm like the slowest person here walking in these stupid boots. Like, they're so difficult. You can't see them, but they're so difficult to walk. Can everybody's in front of me right now entering the lift zone and it's just so difficult to walk. I'm like a snail. I'm slow at walking already and now these boots are just making me even slower. Look, everybody's in front of me. Right? Don't leave me. Ugh, gotta catch up with them. So I just successfully went down the hill three times and I think I'm ready for like the big times, you know? So I'm gonna go tackle that. Little girls have been showing me up the whole day, and it's time to show them who's boss. Get ready for it. Okay. Uh, okay, so I just, I fell off the yeah. this thing too. Did you guys see that? Yeah. Yeah, I fell off and I had to walk all the way up. Uh, and now I'm going to go down my first slope, and here it is, all the way down there. That's what I'm doing. Are you doing a video? Yeah, I'm doing a video. I'm a vlogger. Yeah, so this is going to be my first time going down the hill. I'm with beginners also. Yeah. We're all gonna fall together! Yeah! <laughs> so, I mastered the bunny slopes, and now I'm going to go on the bigger ones. It's called the green slope. Yeah! Going on the bigger slopes! So, I don't know. I think I'm ready because I really was doing well on the other, the smaller slope. And I learned actually from this little girl watching her dad teach her, you know, copying in their moves. And I was doing really well. So time for the bigger and better slopes. The big times. Okay, bye. We're in the lift. We're going all the way up. I don't know if you can see. It's probably really bright. But we're going all the way up. Me and Chloe, ah! <laughs> she's my new friend. <laughs> we're going all the way up and we're going to try and conquer this mountain today because <laughs> she's gone once before as a kid and I've never gone. And it seems like we're going pretty high up this mountain. <gasps> it's a long way down. Don't say that, that'll make me scared. 
But yeah, we're gonna go down this huge hill, and if I don't make another video after this, that means I'm dead. <laughs> Bye. Day two of uh, the skiing experience here at Col Chevelle. I'm going to be hitting the slopes again. I actually didn't hurt myself to any, I didn't hurt myself yesterday. I had a couple of bad falls, but that's all part of the experience. But I'm gonna be head out there again today. I'm so excited. I ain't gonna take my puffer though, cause I'm a little out of breath and I don't wanna have an asthma attack while I'm on the slopes, cause that'd be very tragic. So here we go. See you on the slopes. Oh my yeah, yeah, like my vlog. We're eating lunch on the mountain. And then like the right? skiing soup, like, like cigarette villain. Thank you, it's a lion. Because I have the heart of a lion. Heart of a lion. Lions don't have any, like. Lions do have a heart. Lions have no yeah. hearts. No, but they don't have any, like. Uh, like souls. <laughs> So obviously they give us baguettes for lunch. I finished mine already. It's not even lunch time. It's not even. It's not even lunch time. We're having our baguettes. But why? Why not though? Um, do you yes. have sun cream that on you, Maddie? That appropriate uh, on the French yeah, Alps. Such a beautiful view. No, sorry. Does anyone have any sun cream? On Those anything? mountains. Yeah, you get I don't have sunscreen. I have natural sunscreen. I have black skin. <laughs> do you not get burned? Yeah, no. you do. No, I don't. Surely you can yeah, burn. Yes, you can burn. Have I ever been burnt before, people? No, I haven't. My audience says no. Really? I think you're wrong. I think you can burn. I can burn, but I haven't been burnt. <laughs> I'm telling you, you burn. telling you stuff by your body. You don't can burn. You, I can you, burn. You will burn. <laughs> you will burn. <laughs> In hell! I can come in here. So, guys, yes. I was with some girls and they were taking so long. So now I'm currently by myself at the top of the mountain. I'm trying to make my way down there. I don't know if you can see, I'm trying to make my way down there. Um, Cause there's a lake that we're supposed to meet up for lunch. Yes. Hey, hey James, friends and family. Hi. Hey. So I actually I'm made it. Here. Yes you are, you're right there. Hey. Hi. I made it to um, the chalet where all of them are here. These are the pro skiers. These are the, they go on the red ones, I go on the green and blue. So I made it here safe and sound and this is my big show. It's really show. Let me show you my big show. Anyways, we're going down the longer slopes. Not any reds or blue. Oh, look at all this dessert. I, can't, I don't know if you can do it. Can you turn it around into the other mode? Not, Not well, I, I can, but I'm too I like lazy. Selfie mode. Too lazy. <laughs> yeah, okay, bye. So I just pretty much got back from like the best experience of my whole entire life. Like, I love skiing. I'm addicted to the white powder now. Because, first off, we went to a beautiful resort, Cor Cheval. Courcheval, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's French, obviously. I don't know how to pronounce it. Didn't learn that much yet in France. <sighs> Anyways, yeah, so I had like the best time. We I started off on the baby slopes at first, but then I gradually got better. Mind you, I did fall a lot. Um I, I, I no, no, actually I didn't fall a lot. I fell I fell like twice on the smaller slope. So surprisingly I got I picked up skiing really well. I had the best experience. I mean, I met so many nice people. Uh, I love the fact that I can just, like, I've grown so much as a person here that I can just go by myself to, a, like, a ski trip. I don't have to wait for people to go places and just meet the most awesome people and have a good time. I'm so thankful for the people that I met there because they were awesome. They made my... Like first time experience skiing even better because they helped me put my skis on. They helped me uh, navigate where uh, I should go. They helped me like get down the hill and they waited for me when I fell on my ass at the bottom of the hill. They were so nice and um, yeah. Anyway, the people were very good to me and I, I'm very thankful for them. Uh, but the side effects of skiing is that you are in a lot of pain like currently my whole body hurts and I need to go to bed so that's it from me goodbye world and I'll see you next time on something else I do that's pretty interesting sorry I haven't made a video in forever okay bye